Oh, hey people. So, um, just gonna do a vlog here. Um, first off, you're probably not gonna see me on this device for much longer, so, because I've had it for a couple months, and it's a Blue Life One X. I love the camera, I really like the phone, but it's not charging. It literally has to go to zero. I have to plug it in, leave it for hours on end, and maybe it'll get to 100. Maybe. So, you know, it's like I, there'll be a vast amount of time where I don't have my phone. So, yeah, I'm not happy with it. Um, I've already put out a couple of things on Twitter about it. And if by Thursday when I get my paycheck, I haven't gotten a response from Blue or from Amazon, then this phone is going to get smashed when I buy a new one. And I'm going to be videoing it and posting it on this, ch um, on this channel. And I honestly am just pissed because that's just, I mean, I like the phone. The quality is good. Re you know, I really, I mean, the... The operating system works beautifully, everything works beautifully on it, except for now, two months in, it's not charging, I can't take the battery out, and the second I get done with this vlog, and I have to uh, post it on, you know, post it to YouTube, it's going to drain the battery. Brilliant. So, anyways, um, been a weird couple weeks. Um, started, you know, started playing around, I was with my girl on, on, over this last, um, this last weekend, uh, she was over on Friday night, and we were joking around, and one of the things that she came up with, you know, just, because I had some, uh, plastic bags, from we went shopping, um, uh, went to the Hastings, which is going to be, you know, is my local comic book shop, and uh, went to Walmart and a couple other, you know, a couple other little stops along the way and bought some stuff and had the plastic bags on the bed. And as I was taking, taking the stuff off the bed, she, you know, she, you know, we were talking about, we happened to be talking about uh, doing a scene at an upcoming party. And, you know, she, you know, she said it would be funny if we, you know, if I could flog her with the plastic bags. So, made this. This is a shopping bag flogger. Literally, a shopping bag flogger. This is four bags from Walmart and two bags from, I think one's from Hastings and the other one I'm not exactly sure where it's from. Um, but literally, it's just four shopping, or six shopping bags, uh, some, uh, some string, and some super glue. To keep everything, night you know, check this thing actually works for the most part. It's noisy, noisy as hell. It barely hurts at all. The only parts that actually hurt are probably the strings coated in the super glue. But what it did is give me an idea. And that idea is to uh, start making videos on this channel that are dealing with pervertibles. Now, if you don't know what a pervertible is, a pervertible is literally taking any ordinary object and doing something kinky with it. Um, created some rules in my horrible handwriting. Um, I'm still working on the name, uh, but... Um, the rules as I have them now go something like this. Uh, only things, uh, not normally used as kink toys. So I can't do it. I'm not going to do an episode on chopsticks because those are, can be made into nipple clamps. Now, if you want me to do an episode on nipple clamps, somebody just leave a message below and I'll show you how to do that. It's like one of the world's simplest things to do. Um... Only use stuff anyone can get, so that'll be something that it'll be, you know, that anything I could buy, like, at a dollar store or Walmart or things that are just 
ordinary items and find a way to pervert them. Um, speaking of that, if people want to send me stuff to pervert, I will give you an address to send them to. Um, I'm not going to post the address here because I'm not going to give you my personal address and I don't have a P.O. box at this point. But if you want to send me stuff to do an episode on, I'll be more than happy to give you my address and you can send it to me. Um, on a little bit of epoxy. Uh, never items in epoxy, too easy. Epoxy, epoxy resin, can be easily made into a paddle. Paddles. Stuffing an item into epoxy and making it into a paddle is just way too freaking simple. I don't want to do simple. Must, um, must be usable more than one time play. Uh, it's got to be something like that's not just going to fall apart the first time you play with it. It's got to be something that can last at least two times or three times before it starts falling apart. Um, and number five, must be safe. So I have some modifications I still need to do on that guy because some of these, some of these strings... The you know the super glue has made made it where it could scratch it it could very easily scratch you yeah nice little, nice little scratch marks I don't know if that showed up on camera but yeah those were fun but yeah I it's got to be safe it's got to be something that you can use and enjoy and not going to hurt somebody. Uh, I mean, obviously, kink-related items can, just by their nature, hurt somebody. But uh, not permanently hurt is what I mean. So, um, I'm thinking kink it or pervert it. You know, something like that is the title of the show. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet. But I'm thinking I'm going to wind up doing that as a... Um, semi-regular or regular type of like maybe weekly type of build project um but i need things to build so if you got suggestions throw them below if you got something you want to send me send me a message on fet um you know i be more than happy to do an episode once i get another once i get a camera that actually works properly um like i said this thing is sucking right now and so, unless Blue contacts me by Thursday, you'll see a video on Friday of me smashing this phone with my new phone. So, that's kind of it for now. Um, you know, it is what it is. So, you know, like, subscribe, comment. That's it for now. Be well and safe.